If he makes it out of this alive, I'll be pretty surprised. Hey, wait for me. I mean, that pretty much... There's no doubt left for what Dutch's priorities are. And I think when things settle down, I'll likely confront him and be like, listen, this happened with John, this happened with me, you call us both son. It's bullshit. Has been for a while. on there, buddy. Hang on there. This can be rough. For Christ's sake. Come on. I don't know why we need to stay with him. We're trying to save this dude's life. Something. You have nothing to be sorry for. You know. Oh, they probably wanted to talk Dutch. that whole time. Dutch is. I guess my thinking is he used you. He wasn't trying to help anyone but himself and his own crazy principles. We're grown men. Nobody made us do anything. Are we going? Maybe I'm talking for my people as much as for yours. We saw he turned crazy, and we couldn't believe it, and we followed him anyway. Things should never have gone this far. You see... Bring him to me. He's gone. My son. What are they gonna do now? They must move and fast. I'll stay and help them. Yeah, I'll stay too. No, my friend. You have others who need you. Good people. I'm sorry, but we... We must pack and move. I'm like, I'm almost flabbergasted with how much he's getting away with, and there's still people that are like, oh yeah, no, Dutch is the way, but whatever. You can feel it like it's coming to a boiling point. It's happening. Uh-oh. 
Oh no, not here. No, no, no. Chucky, go! Scary to think about the fact that people would take us in too because Please. it's so easy to transmit Please. the disease Please. and they have no idea. Rest a moment. Besser Englisch Sie haben uns gerettet, als wir wirklich Hilfe brauchten. Oh, remember those Germans? We went and got the, the husband and brought him back, and they were in like the little wooded area. That's crazy. <laughs> what the? Chucky followed us the whole way. When you work, when you do work for the gang, half the take is set aside for gang savings. The other half is split between the gang members who work in the jail. Yeah. Okay. Okay, fella. We're back in uh, Ansburg. Okay. Hello, we need to get the hell out of here. This is somebody this is somebody we saved, I guess. Uh, howdy. I was just telling my friend here about how I nearly died out there one night. Ooh, sounds like quite a tale. Here's an idea. Gunsmith's a friend. Pick out what you nice. want and I'll pick up the tab. Hmm? It's Jenkins. Ooh, yes indeed. Anything for you, buddy. All right, Anything. Jenkins. You are nothing if not generous. That's kind of you. Thanks. You're very welcome, friend. All the best. Well, he did save my life after all. I probably would have gotten an open, but I said it so right. You really got me. Oh, it's the uh, bear trap. One of the bear trap guys. <laughs> That's funny. Hey, friend, what do you need? A gun. A town named Jenkins owes me. Said I could put something on his tab. Jenkins, huh? All right, take a look around. So we got the semi-auto. Repeating, uh, could be good. Just want to see what kind of... We have all the repeaters we could want. All right, I guess we take the repeating. So noted. You have a good day now. We gotta pimp this thing out, obviously. Uh, I'm not gonna do a wrap, because I like to have the engravings. The carvings, I should say. We have a gold one. Let's do a let's do this one in silver. We can maybe stay with like a we'll do a black and steel trigger. Okay, these are all set. We must start thinking. Stop 
leaving. Stop dreaming, start thinking. Let's do the wolf. And varnish will go dark again. Okay, and then lastly, let's get some shotgun shells. Let's fill up on kind of everything. All right. Look at it. It's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. Thank you, Jenkins. Boy. Yeah, you all right there, boy? Did that guard freak out on us? I'm not sure what that was about, but... Do we have any more of the... Yeah, okay, this'll do. Give ourselves a treat. We've earned it. Me, Bill, you knob. Wondered when you'd roll back in. Won't take a minute, boy. All right, Chucky. For now, I'm gonna ride with our new friend Buell here. Get him trained up. All right. Just going to clean up a bit while we're here. I think we have... I think we have a hair tonic somewhere. Right here. Oh, hey, Arthur. Hey. What you want, Mike? Don't talk to me. Nothing. I'm just being civil, my brother. Yeah. Well, at least you ain't run off. You really are very charming. What you talking about? Pearson left. Old uncle. The traitors. Both gone at dawn. They said to young Tilly they were running to save themselves. I think Mary Beth left as well. So it goes. They are goddamn cowards, Arthur. Cowards. Of all the time we spend to run off. Well, I guess they don't want to die, Dutch. Ain't nobody gonna. 
And this is a tough time. And you ain't, you ain't doing too well. But we, our community, we will survive. They will not crush us. I hope so. But if we let Jack and the women free, well then there maybe ain't we no can freedom for no one in this country no more, Arthur. One more big score, we got enough money to leave. All this turmoil has the army and Pinkerton spinning. We take a boat and slip away. I don't know what you're saying, Dutch, but it seems like I've heard it all before. Just one more and train. And a goddamn train. Arthur, <coughs> this is different. Everyone is different. This is full of cash. Army payroll, money and supplies to repair the bridge that you blew. This is all. Going to plan. We rob Uncle Sam and we leave. <laughs> the poetry of it all. What do you think? It sounds wonderful. Hell, yeah. I ain't got much to lose, but you know, the women and the children. And John and his family. I'm afraid I have to insist. I mean, we gotta let them go, because if the Pinkertons come through again, they will kill everyone. John? Insist? Yeah. Yeah. Insist. Of course, pal. Whatever you think is best, I will. See to it, huh? Now, are we gonna rob a train? Jesus. Sure. Oh, it's so frustrating. It's so frustrating. We will survive. We will flourish. We have work to do, my friends. Let's go. Come on. We are gonna borrow a little money from old Uncle Sam and be out of his hair once and for all. He insists upon it. Insists. <laughs> Let's ride out, gentlemen. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. He's pissed. Okay, let's make sure that we're set here. Having a train in the middle of a city? No. It's going to stop there. Take on mail water. Let off some bolts. It's hit home on leave, and then it heads out. They know the bridge is gone, Black Lung. Uh oh There'll be a patrol past Annisburg, waiting down by the river to collect the money. We sneak on quietly, and then we got a short time to stop the train before it reaches the patrol. Sounds foolproof. John, you go get that dynamite. We'll meet back up outside of San Denis. I'll go with him. As you wish. Come on. Nice. It's this way. Maybe this is where we can convince him to leave. We blew the bridge. This is one big goddamn group of us to be riding back into San Denis. Yeah. I heard the Pinkertons have pretty much taken over Van Horn. Moved a whole heap of men in there. Things are closing in fast. Shit. Be just through these trees. There it is. <laughs> I'll get the dynamite. No, I can do it. You sure? <laughs> I'm fine. Huh? Okay. It's in the back. Got it. 
Is that all, all we right. need? Let's get this done. So listen, Abigail just told me the money. It's hidden in the caves at Beaver Hollow. What? Yeah. So much for never hiding it near camp. Dutch was getting even sloppier than we thought. Wow, okay. Are Abigail and Jack ready to leave? I think so. Okay. Whatever happens with this job today, <laughs> wherever Dutch and them go next, we're getting you to help. Out of here. We're going to get you the money you need. Knowing the three of you got out, well, maybe all of this will still mean something. Tilly and Susan, too. I'll do whatever it takes. I wish we would encourage them to go before the job. Always back, Arthur. Well, uh, perhaps not always. Anyway, here we go. One last train, Arthur. One last train. Jesus. Different. Sounds about as good now as every time I heard it before. Oh, Abigail must be real excited. All packed up like she is. Uh oh. I could just see her in the little grass skirt. Don't talk to me, you son of a bitch. Boys, boys. Okay, now let's keep it down. We don't want to draw attention to ourselves going through. Here. Nice and easy through town, fellas. Ah, uh, San Denis. It's good to be back. Happy memories, huh, John? Will you shut up, Macca? That's enough. Quiet. All of you. Not much further now. What is this? You got something to hide. Show me your face. That's right. <laughs> Let's see if we can get in a quick gun clean in here. Bring this bad boy up to its full potential. You know damn rights we're gonna need it. What did you stop for? I'm cleaning my gun, bro. Like you should be doing. Alright. Cleet, Sadie, you board halfway along. John, you and Arthur are gonna board at the back. Rest you. Follow Mike and I, and join once they stop the train. Here she comes. Should I just sneak on now? <laughs> God damn it. Well, everybody mount up. Good plan. Still going through with this? Of course we are.